This is Joe Modai, Mapping Technical Support for Silar Instrument, and today on this Tech Tip video, we are going to talk about coordinate systems in TerraSync, how and why to use them. First thing I'm going to do is open up TerraSync on my Geo7X. The first screen that we will see will be the status and sky plot screen within TerraSync. I'm then going to hit the drop down and then go to setup. I'm then going to click on the coordinate system tab and this will allow me to change the coordinate system on the unit itself. As you can see TerraSync defaults to latitude longitude WGS 1984. This is what the unit itself collects in. I am able to change this into US State Plane 1983 Missouri East. Putting the new coordinate system in there it actually does not change the way that I collect data it is actually only changing the coordinate system of the viewable map in TerraSync. This will allow me to import in shape files that I might have in a certain coordinate system or even my own background imagery into TerraSync. So to recap, when we actually change the coordinate system within TerraSync, we are only changing the viewable map coordinate system and not the coordinate system that we are collecting our data in. Thank you for watching this Siler Instrument Tech Tip video. Follow us on our blogs and our socials listed below for more Tech Tip videos just like this.